What's up everyone, welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'm not gonna talk about my Alfa Romeo Giulia Cochafolios ownership and also list five reasons why you should buy one now. Let's go. So here's my quad. I got it all covered up by a factory car cover. This car cover is the most beautiful car cover I ever see. So let's take off the car cover and go to the place that we can talk a little more about it. Let's go. Cold start. My fuel is low, let's go get some fuel. So here's the place, um, so let's talk about the ownership first. So I own this car for a year right now, around a year. Um, I have only one issue for this car, so it's the front splitter. So um, this front splitter will come out when you are 80 or 90 miles per hour, I'm not sure. But at one time, one of the motor broken for no reason, so I ran to the dealership. The good thing is they cover me under the warranty, so I didn't have to pay anything. And other than that, I have no issue for this car. So I have around 30,000 miles for the car, and the car has been running great and no issues. So I'm not a car review, so I will list five things that I think I will motivate you to buy this car in my opinion so let's get it okay so the first thing is how unique this car is so you guys can see this front end it is very unique so for this um, triangle grill and also this headlight i don't see any other car manufacturer like do the front bumper like this i just in love with it some of the people might don't might not like it um it's for personal preference so um i'm the people that really like it and also these wheels i think only afro romeo make this wheel almost all the people love those wheels so and also for the rear end it looks so aggressive and there's so many aerodynamic stuff that make this car go fast so even the brake for this car is very unique because uh, I have the carbon ceramic brake option. Um, I don't know about the normal brake. And the brake pedal just feel a little bit weird because when you first hit the pedal, it don't give you the power insistently. And it just, when you get to the point that have the power, it give you too much power. And that's a little bit weird, but it is one of the unique thing about this car okay for the second thing i would say is how fast this car go and also for the exhaust note and this car is fast and when you into the first gear hit the gas pedal you don't feel any acceleration because the tire just spinning but when you get to the second gear when you can put the power down it's like a rocket ship 
also for the exhaust i will give you guys some clip um you guys can hear it This is the best sounding car I have ever driven. I have not driven um, Ferrari, Lamborghini. Um, I think for what I have driven, this is the best sounding car. Okay, so the third thing I would say is the steering of this car. I actually drove the normal Julia before I bought this car. So the steering is light and responsive. If you have never driven the Alfa Romeo before, please go test drive one because it will blow your mind. I'm, I mean, this is one of the biggest reasons why I bought this car. It feels so responsive and feel very light and very comfortable. And you can feel everything on the road. For other like Audi, they are light, but they feel nothing on the road. And I just don't like the feeling of it. This one is like a perfect feeling. So for the fourth thing, I would say is how many carbon fiber they have on this car. Look at this front end. They got uh, front splitter as a carbon fiber, this grill carbon fiber, badge carbon fiber, even this hood is carbon fiber. And move to the side, you got the carbon fiber side splitter, and also you can see this carbon fiber um, rear spoiler. But the uh, only thing that I think they should make carbon fiber too is this diffuser. Um, I really don't know why they don't make this as carbon fiber because this plastic just looks so cheap I mean you got everything else is carbon fiber but you should make the real diffuser match it and also for the interior you can see there's a lot of carbon fiber there carbon fiber on a steering wheel carbon fiber on a center console also carbon fiber carbon fiber even the seat it's carbon fiber and I just don't remember how many carbon fiber words that I have said it's just too too many carbon fiber if you like carbon fiber you definitely should get this car or go check one out yeah so even the roof is carbon fiber so um, the fifth thing is uh, the price range of this car um, I definitely encourage you to buy it used because um, this car depreciates a lot um, for my car um, the new is 90k now it's uh, 55k for value um, so that's pretty big difference you can get 40% off by buying it used I mean so Another benefit for buying it used is you can see a lot of cars that have buyback or lemon title on the car that less than uh, 10k mile. So I would say um, if this car go over to 20k miles, it will be like the car without any problem because most of the problem appear before 20k. I would say that's just my opinion. It's not anything the factory said yeah so here's the five reason that why i what i think that will motivate you to buy this car all right so this will end today's video so if you guys like my video please subscribe and leave a like also comment below for what i have to improve and what content would you guys like to see yeah see you guys next time